Hey guys, if you were following me on Instagram, I blocked this large square and it basically went to the edges of this mat that I have. All four corners were right to the edges because I used thicker yarn. And so really this other piece underneath that I'm about to show you is supposed to match it, but I used different yarn. Shouldn't really be using scrap yarn, but ta-da! There it is. So this one I can only stretch it this far. Um, there's a bit of a gap and of course you have to make the gap even. I don't know how much you know about blocking. So this, if you're interested in knowing, was originally a pattern in my Mother's Day crochet along in 2020 and it's a sunflower, maybe you can tell. And I had it written up for interlocking and then I used that same chart and wrote up the overlay mosaic, which means that in this space here there was actually dots because that's the nature of interlocking. So I have updated the pattern, well actually I haven't updated it yet, I did update it but it's not live. I updated the pattern for me. <laughs> and now it doesn't have, for the mosaic version, it's all thick, so you don't have those interlocking mesh dots. And then I also created these sunflower leaves because they match the sunflower. Of course, my piece won't actually join together, but we're gonna pretend I'm a real designer and that that was not just a mistake from using scrap yarn, right? You guys love me anyways. And I have a third piece to go with it. Give me a sec. And here is the third piece, which is, maybe you can tell because I'm putting it right on top, see? Leaves, leaves. And there's a sunflower in the bottom corner. So this one is called Sunflower and Leaves, right? Maybe I'll back up a little, you can see the whole thing. And this is obviously the mosaic version without the toe, little polka dots from the interlocking. And this one is called sunflower leaves because it's the leaves from a sunflower. You got it? Don't get confused. And this one is just called sunflower, although actually I think it goes this direction or it might be upside down. I'm not sure. Whoops, that's a bit heavier than I thought it was going to be. So there's three pieces. This one is going to be updated. If you already have the Mother's Day crochet along, I'll update this file and you can have the thick version. But the other flowers haven't been updated, so you're going to have to let me know if that's something you really need. I can update all the flowers to have this, the dots removed. And I'm also going to have an ebook that has, oops, sorry, my very handy camera skills. I don't have my setup, I'm just using my crazy space. Everyone will remember the time that Ashley's family moved a million zillion times. Um, so I'm going to have an ebook, and it's going to have this sunflower in it, and it's going to have this leaves pattern. However, this leaves pattern is going to have right and left handed instructions, so if you wanted, you could have the leaves coming up here and going in that way. So you could actually make a blanket where they're facing all both directions. So the written instructions will be for both. And then same for this one, the written instructions will be right and left handed, which really just means, hi sweetie, don't eat the Lego, no thank you. Uh, that's my two-year-old Melody. So she is eating Lego, but really she's not. She just likes to tell me she is because it's funny. So this one will have right and left-handed instructions as well so that you can, if you're left-handed, you'll have to use the opposite of what you're actually looking for, right? But these flowers are right now pointing towards the right, or if you wanted them to be coming up this way and pointing towards the left. And then this would be in the bottom other corner. So that'll allow you to do some mix and matching so the sunflower ebook is going to have just these three designs, but these two really have two options. So it's like five. And of course, they're all written up for interlocking and mosaic. The mosaic instructions. Hi, I'm just making video sweets. What happened to you? Oh, my hair. I put my hair in crazy curls because we're trying to have fancy hair tomorrow. So these... Um, these mosaic versions that don't have the polka dots, in the Mother's Day crochet along, you will have your regular flowers that have all the polka dots, and only this flower is going to have this updated mosaic. And in the Sunflower ebook, you'll have these written up for interlocking and mosaic, but the mosaic version will only be like this without the polka dots. 
So I know that that is confusing. I hope my video makes it less confusing, although my children interrupt and my camera's too close to the picture, so maybe it's not that helpful. I don't know. I'm trying here. I don't know. I don't know. Now you can see I'm crazy when I'm crazy. No, that's not the right words. Yeah, I'm crazy. <laughs> no. Okay, so that is my video. I was trying to show you some stuff. That's what I got. I do. Thanks. I gotta go, children. <laughs> Bye.